Welcome to Australian Immigration Updates. Join our WhatsApp group for latest updates about immigration news. Link is given in description, where we navigate the complexities of the immigration system. Your one-stop shop for all things visas down under. Today, we're diving deep into the transit visa, subclass 771. Whether you're a frequent flyer or a first-time traveler, this visa might be your key to a smooth stopover in Australia. So let's get started. What is a transit visa, subclass 771? This visa allows you to stay in Australia for up to 72 hours, three days, while you're on your way to another destination. Think of it as a pit stop where you can stretch your legs, grab a bite, or even explore a bit before hopping back on your journey. But remember, it's not a tourist visa so you can't stay longer than permitted and must have confirmed onward travel arrangements. Who needs a transit visa? Subclass 771. Not everyone needs this visa. Check if you're eligible for transit without a visa, TWOV, based on your nationality and travel plans. But if you're not on the TWOV list or your layover exceeds 72 hours, then the subclass 771 comes to the rescue. Applying for a transit visa, subclass 771. The good news. This visa is free and relatively straightforward to apply for. You can lodge your application online or through an Australian embassy slash consulate. Gather your documents, including your passport, flight details, and proof of onward travel, and follow the application instructions carefully. Conditions and limitations of the transit visa. Subclass 771. Remember, this visa has limitations. You can't work, study, or engage in any business activities in Australia. You also can't leave the airport transit area unless you have a transit visa with stay permission. Make sure you understand these restrictions before applying. Processing time and validity. Most applications are processed within 19 days, so plan accordingly. Once granted, the visa is usually valid for a single entry and expires after your 72-hour stay in Australia. Things to do on a transit visa, subclass 771. If you have some time to spare, Australia offers plenty for a quick taste. Explore iconic landmarks like the Sydney Opera House or Melbourne's Laneways, indulge in delicious local cuisine, or simply relax in a park and soak up the sunshine. Remember, your activities must comply with your visa conditions. Beyond the transit visa, subclass 771. If you're planning a longer stay or want to experience more of Australia, explore other visa options like the visitor visa, subclass 600, or the working holiday visa, subclass 417. Our channel has dedicated videos on these visas to help you choose the right one for your needs. Thanks for joining us on this journey through the transit visa, subclass 771. Remember, we're here to answer your questions and guide you through your Australian visa journey. So hit that subscribe button, explore our other videos, and let's make your dream down under a reality.